What is cracking you fishing Jim Oaks Eastern PA fishing here? It is a cold and windy day and I don't really want to go fishing, but they are stocking Penny Pack Creek today with fresh stock trout. This is one of the few options that are available for people this time of year to catch stock trout. They don't stock too many creeks, so the ones that they do are pretty special. A lot of people seem to just forget about the fall stocks or maybe just not know about them, but it's always nice going out there fishing for some fresh trout with a little less pressure. Anyway, I hope you guys all like the content. If at any point in time you do, please scroll down below, hit that thumbs up button. Also subscribe to the Eastern PA Fishing YouTube channel if you have not already. Eastern PA Fishing here, you know what it is by now. Let's get right to the fishing. We are making our way to a spot now. Hopefully we're gonna catch a bunch of them today. Should be a fun little episode. Let's get down to the creek, get some real estate. They should be stocking here in about 10 to 15 minutes. Hope everybody is excited for the fall trout season. It is finally here, everybody. It looks like so far we have the place all to ourselves. Hopefully getting here this early isn't a mistake. Not really trying to freeze my keister off before I get a chance to catch some trout. You know, these trucks do always show up late. Been here for about 20 minutes now, sitting and waiting still. Trucks are already 10, 15 minutes late. They usually typically are, so not really too worried about that. It's just so weird being out here, being the only person out here right now. Almost like an opening day. Just sitting here waiting for them to put the trout in there so I can catch them. I am definitely looking to take some home today though. Probably looking to take home at least two. The limit in fall is three. You don't want to be caught with more than that. Two fish is enough to feed one person anyway. Hopefully they put some big ones in here. I knew it was going to take this long. I would have came a little later. Make sure you make that water slam. All right. Slam them in. Yeah, man. Trout. You too, man. Take care. Well, this isn't the coolest thing ever. I don't know what it is. Stocking trout. And now I get to fish for them right away. Let's see if we can get one out of here. Little pink worm. Do your job. One looked at it already. They're curious about that little worm. Don't know how much longer I'm gonna have the creek to myself. There's gonna be a bunch of people packing in here pretty soon. Wonder how a spinner would do on these dudes. See if we can get one out of this hole. It'd be a big pain in the keister to try to throw a spinner through all these leaves. Hopefully these trout turn on soon. Oh, there we go. First one of the day if we can land them. There we go. First one of the day. Look at the pale colors on that fish. That is gonna be lunch part one. Want at least two of these guys for lunch. The rest we're gonna put back. Thank you, Mr. Stocked Rainbow Trout. You have served your purpose on this planet. Got ourselves some lunch, or at least half of it. Gonna keep this guy in the water so he stays nice and fresh. Cold water is great for keeping your trout fresh this time of year. Well, now that we got the first bite, we should be turning on a little bit. Should be able to catch some more out of here. The next one I keep, I want to be a little bit bigger than that one, but I do like the taste of the smaller trout. Let's see if we can get another one. I can see a whole bunch of them right out there. Yellow trout magnet time. Should be able to see this a little better under the water. It might be getting a little too cold out here for me. I'm gonna last shot this, throw around a spinner, see if I can get bit on that. Well, everybody, I think that's gonna wrap it up for today's fishing session. I am just freezing my keister off here. It's got a giant snag, lost all my line. So we're taking our one lonely tiny trout home to cook and eat when they first stock them in there they aren't really too willing to bite but overall it was a good day out here 
really wasn't as many people that showed up that I thought it was going to. But I guess as the week continues, more and more people will show up. I'm sure this place is going to be absolutely packed during the weekend. Just glad we could get out here, catch ourselves a little lunch. Anyway, I hope you guys all liked the content. If at any point in time you did, please scroll down below, hit that thumbs up button. Also, subscribe to the Eastern PA Fishing YouTube channel if you have not already. Eastern PA Fishing here, you know what it is by now. Until next time, guys, stay safe, stay tuned, and always stay fishy.